Hello, it's Monday. <laughs> and we are going to eat one of Jack's favorite things. We've never made it this way, but we're going to make it this way. But Jack loves... Meatballs. Meatballs. He does love his meatballs. So, we bought um, two packages of these little biscuits. So what we're going to do is we're going to take one, Jack, and we're going to poke out just the center of it. Like that. See how we did it? You want to dig? Here, let me do another one. Watch what I'm doing. Reach like that. Reach down. And pull out. Just like that. You can get one big piece. So you're going to want to do it for all 12 of them. And it says you only need 12 um, of your meatballs. But actually, these ones are kind of small, aren't they, Jack? Yeah. So we're going to do... Two in each one. How's it coming, Jack? You getting it? I know one way of doing that easier. What? Cutting it. Oh, that'll take a long time. <laughs> you can do it, Jack. Watch again. Take your fingers, spread it apart, bury it down there, and just pull out. Just like that. And then you got all that extra bread. <laughs> so we're going to pull all these out. While we're doing this, I want to thank all of our new subscribers. You guys are the bomb, diggity. I hope that all of you, even if you don't have a channel, you um, can join our two different collabs that we have for October. And so we can see some of the ideas that you guys have. Because believe it or not... Jack doesn't come up with the ideas, so I have to sit there every day and I, yeah. Jack, and figure out what we're going to do. <laughs> so, yeah, I love to learn new ideas. I think it's great. Um, let me get in here real quick, Jack. I think I have two of these, don't I? Or maybe just one. Oh, I do have two. Okay. So while Jack's getting his rest of his done, I have in this bowl, I have... Um, minced garlic, melted butter, and parsley. And you're going to take just a little bit and pour in each bowl, each one of these things here. <coughs> and then I'm going to brush them. And if you guys have any ideas, I've just about caught up to everybody. I just got to do the, um... Apple cider uh, donuts, right, Jack? Is that what it was? Apple yeah. cider donuts. Yep. And then I think I've done every request that I've gotten. <laughs> See, you did mine. Yep, I did even Jack's. So now you want to just brush kind of the sides with all that. If there's a piece that you didn't get, you can just dip your, your um, thing back in there. Because you want to kind of coat your walls, too of your bread. Coat your walls. That sounded kind of weird, didn't it? Yeah. Because this is supposed to be garlic bread um, meatballs. This week we're doing all comfort food that is not good for you. <laughs> How about that? I've got Four days of non-healthy food that's comfort food planned. Well, that reminds me that last order was on the porch, Jack. Uh, I brought it in, except for my cereal. <laughs> oh, well, we need to put that cheese in the fridge. Alrighty, now, I put it closer to you. Oh. Now, we're going to put two meatballs, which are already pre-cooked. We're going to put two meatballs inside of every one of these. Because like I said, they were small meatballs. We bought them from Walmart. See how tiny they are? They're really small. So I told Jack, I said, you know, I think we could probably put two in there. And then you get more of a mouthful, you know? Jack's like, as long as it's meatballs, we're good. Yeah. My husband likes meatballs too. I'm not the biggest fan. I just am not. I don't know. I'll eat them, but if I had to go a lifetime without eating meatballs, I'd be fine. 
Jack would probably die. <laughs> Jack would be like, no life without meatballs, no. We can't have it. I need my meatballs. I could go a lifetime without spaghetti too. But now goulash, I love. Weird, right? Alrighty. So there's all mine in there. Jack Sloan is up, as usual. I'm kidding. <laughs> Jack's like, bear with me. <laughs> Today is pick on Jack Day. Yeah. But actually, we did that a lot yesterday, too, didn't oh, we? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we really did. Yeah, we picked on me yesterday. We really gave it to him yesterday, big time. So then I want you to take some more of that butter and just kind of lick it on the top of that bread. Oh, this stuff smells so good, Jack. Yep. How come I gave you the big fancy one? I got the cheap one from the dollar store and it don't work with crap. Here, you use that one. <laughs> <laughs> well, I could have brought mine one. <laughs> this other one's really nice. So just spread it along the top. You stay in there, meatball. He's talking to his meatballs, you guys. Maybe we've pushed him too far. Maybe he's losing it. Alrighty, there's mine. Oh, oh, oh. oh my gosh, Jack, smell those. Mm. Don't they smell good? Oh yeah. Alright, now the next thing we're going to do, did you get all 12 of yours? Yeah. Okay. Alright, now the next thing, I even gave him his own spoon. See, there's two spoons in there. So now we're going to do just the... Um, Marinara on the top of the meatballs. Tom's going to love this because he loves meatballs too. And then I'm just going to do a vegetable on the side. Obviously you don't need garlic bread on the side because you already have it. <laughs> yeah, it smells like garlic bread. It does too. It smells really good, you guys. Really good. Oh, that looks great. These are really cute, Jack. Yeah. You know, this would be something really great to take, like, to church bazaars or, yeah. you know, or family reunions or something. Oh, oh Jack made a, made a mess. Time to fire him. That's it's it. about time I make a mess. What? <laughs> he acts like he's totally innocent, but guys, totally not. All right, now, did you get all yours? Well, you just, like, zip, zip through, don't you? Um, you want to grab that Italian seasoning. Now you're going to put a little bit of cheese on top of both. Or all of them, I should say. Jack's getting old. He has to turn the light on so he can see. Yeah, I can't even see my glasses on. <laughs> oh, I tell you right here. We seem to use that one an awful lot, don't we? Yeah. Alright, so put cheese on the top of all of them, Jack. And kind of just keep it on top of your um, spaghetti sauce or your marinara. These look amazing, you guys. Oh my goodness. I think I'm going to use just a little bit more. Alright, then I didn't do up a recipe card. This is just going to be something that I do. I, I took the idea from somebody else, but... I didn't use their full recipe, so I will type it in. You want yours to have some on there, too? You don't put very much cheese on there, Jack. I want it more cheesy than that. All right. All right. So this is what it looks like before it goes in. So we will put these in the oven until everything's nice and bubbly and browning on, on top of that. And I'll be back when Tom gets home to taste test it. You gonna say goodbye? Bye. All right, I'll be back, guys. All right, there's the garlic bread meatballs, and the Kahuna's gonna try it. Didn't get no meatball now. Well, he better get a meatball. While he's getting the meatball, I want to thank all of you new subscribers and all that you've been right here with me all along. We're growing, and I appreciate it. It takes every single one of you. Please like, share, subscribe, 
and hit that bell in case, you know, I do a live or anything again. So what do you think, Tom? Mm. That's good. One through ten. Thirty-five. <laughs> so I take it you'd have it again? Mm-hmm. All right, tell everybody bye, Tom. Do what? Tell everybody bye, Tom. Bye, Tom. Have a blessed day, guys.